Something that is talked about quite a bit, but uh, there's a facet totally left out of it. The issue of microaggressions that you may have heard of. Whenever microaggressions are brought up, the definition is an act or a statement given by the offender that uh, that is unintend unintendedly offensive. Um, they they might uh, walk up to a person and say, "Oh, you speak beautiful English." Or they might say something uh, like, uh, well, tell me, where were you born? And the person will say, uh, Detroit. And the person will say, no, 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 no. I mean, you know, where are you really from? The purpose of all these things is, it's, it, it the def, pardon me, the definition of these that is constantly given whenever you look for a uh, definition of microaggression is, it is an offense that is unintentionally perpetrated upon a person in a marginalized community. Uh, more than half the time, and a black person, of course, in the United States, at least for a black person, because we have a very special uh, history of domestic slavery that is uh, really not, uh, uh, not seen anywhere else in the world. Uh, Europe, of course, had slavery, but uh, three out of four slaves taken from Africa uh, were sent uh, to corporations in the Caribbean to work the sugar farms and die on the sugar farms. Whereas, uh, so they had no domestic slavery to speak of uh, it, in anything like the United States had domestic slavery. So it's a it's it's uh, that history makes uh, uh, makes a native uh, black person in the United States makes their situation totally totally different uh, from uh, from those throughout Europe. A microaggression then is defined as an unintentional slight given to a person of a marginalized community by the offender. But that, that ignores the purpose of a microaggression. The purpose of a microaggression is to insult. It is not unintentional. It is designed to insult, to cause the person to be identified as outside, as without a voice, as other, as uh, not uh, worthy of, of respect. It is designed to do that with plausible deniability on the, on the part of the offender. Because what's the first thing the offender will do when offense is taken? They'll say, I was just complimenting you on how nice your English was. I was just wanting to get to know you better to find out where you're really from when you're when you're from, you know, Pasadena. Uh, the purpose is always to give offense with plausible deniability so that when you give offense, and offense is taken, then the offender can take offense. That offense was taken from their insult purposefully given. That is the purpose of a microaggression to leave an opening. Because as my brother used to always say, what's the first part of every single bigoted racist joke? Here's the opening part to every single racist and bigoted joke. It goes like this. <laughs> they used to crack me up every time my brother told that joke. Um, that is the first part. You do not want to be the bigot. Bigots are not admired in our country. So you have to do it sneaky and underhanded and lie about it. Because that's what a bigot does. That's who a bigot is. That's what a white, white supremacist is all about. 
I didn't want to tell him anything, but I was just trying to say something, something good about him. Plausible deniability in your position as a bigoted racist.